This is Justin with Bulldog Rooter. This is an upload video for job number 594-98825. I repeat, 594-98825. Today's date is August 7th, 2024. I was called out originally on August 1st for two floor drains that were backing up into the basement. Uh, upon arrival on site, the customer directed me to the basement where I did observe um, the floor drain in the mechanical room um, was backed up, had some water around it, as well as right next door in a storage room there was a second floor drain uh, both tied into each other and this one was backed up as well with some water in it. Um, at that time the customer did state that he had a new water filtration system hooked up and installed. Um, I could see the discharge hoses going into the floor drain in the mechanical room. Uh, we tested for a main line by running water in the home for several minutes, flushed toilets several times, and this did not cause the floor drains to back up any further, therefore determined that there was a blockage of some kind in the floor drain. Um, I was able to remove the cast iron uh, cleanout plug in the floor drain in the storage room and run the secondary cable, was able to get the water to drain and clear. I then tested by dumping several five gallon buckets of water into each floor drain and we did not see the floor drains back up at that time. We also tested the water filtration system by having it discharge um, and that did not cause the floor drains to back up either. Um, so at that time we determined that we were able to um, cable out whatever was blocking the line. Um, a couple days went by and the customer did call, um, came downstairs and the morning after he woke up and did see that the floor drains backed up again. Um, so at that time, gave us a call, I returned out here and recommended running a camera just to see if there was any obstruction in the pipe or anything further going on. Uh, upon, upon inspecting the uh, two inch cast iron pipe um, on the camera, I did observe a lot of sediment um, and some corroding going on in the cast iron pipe. Um, so I made recommendations to the customer to either um, provide an estimate to saw cut, jackhammer up the floor and replace the cast iron pipe with ABS or to at least um, try to descale and flush the sediment and cast iron flaking out of the line and try to get better flow. A uh, customer at that time accepted the estimate to have us return and descale and flush the line to see if that would improve symptoms. Um, so I have been spending some time pacoding this line. Um, like I said, it is two inch cast iron. I was able to descale a large majority of the corrosion and cast iron um, flaking inside the pipe and then followed behind with the mini jetter flushing out any sediment and cast iron flaking that we broke up in the pipe. Um, while mini jetting, I did not see the floor drain back up um, and I could see good drainage and flow out here into the main line. Right now we're in the floor drain line. We're looking at where it ties into the main line. So we'll start pulling the camera back and just inspect the line. So this is two inch cast iron see it is still very rough I mean we were able to I was able to pacote um, a large majority and spent quite a bit of time doing that um, however I don't want to continue pushing the pacote machine and risk breaking the pipe or compromising it further and we were able to flush out a large majority of the sediment and cast iron flaking in the pipe However, just looking at the condition of this pipe, I would still recommend to the customer at some point in the, in the near future um, just replacing this section of pipe um, and having it redone with ABS. So as you can see, still some sediment in there, some cast iron flaking possibly some channel rots, just hard to tell, hard to see.
as you can see, very rough throughout. And we're coming back towards the floor drain. Here's our floor drain, our clean out where the work was performed today. This does conclude your video upload. Thank you for choosing Bulldog Rooter.